What's up, everybody? Today we are doing more Kit Kats from more Kit Kats from around the world. Um, I know I said I was getting some on different dates, but I wanted to break them up to hopefully make the videos a little bit shorter. Um, if you missed my uh, mint chocolate chip um Kit Kat video, go check that out. That will be in the candy playlist as well as this video. So let's get started. I will tell you they are all in different languages. Um, so I do not know what the flavors are unless there's a picture of it on the front. And there is with some, some are not. So I believe this one is, um, what was it? Chestnut flavored. Like in the U.S., we just have the same three boring flavors. At least they came out with like a mint and chocolate one in the U.S. at least. So it just looks like a normal Kit Kat. This is really good. Sorry about that. I had to move something out of the way. Um, it kind of almost tastes like what the American flavor birthday cake would be. Um, but a little bit different. I don't really know how to explain it. Uh -uh. This next one is... Oh, why am I even saying that? Because I can't read it. Because <laughs> uh, it's in a different language. So, I do not know what these are. Now, I've heard you can get um, them from Japan Crate, and Japan Crate is a subscription box, and they have everything translated for you, um, but I got these off Amazon, so it will just be as interesting for me as it will be for you guys, but I don't think it's actually that bad, because then, um... Um, because then I'm not, like, turned off by, oh, this is going to be gross, just by looking at the flavor. Um, so this one is actually green, which is kind of scaring me. Um, and if you notice, in different countries, they have the white on the back, in the background with red letters. In America, we have, um, white letters with red. So just the same logo, but back, um, the other way around. Um. This kind of tastes like spinach. Or I shouldn't say taste. Smells like spinach, so I'm kind of scared to try it. Yeah, that's definitely spinach, kale, asparagus, seaweed, or something. Because that was gross. Really gross, like horrible aftertaste also. This and that was like a dark green wrapper if I didn't show that this is the next one. With a lime green coloring. This one is like greenish too, which is kinda unique because in our country we also don't have colored ones besides for like holidays and stuff um
This one personally doesn't taste like anything. Um, just like a regular cream and wafer cookie. I mean, judging by the green, maybe like lemon cream, lime cream pie or something. Um, but I cannot tell the flavor off of that. But that vegetable one or whatever that is, that was nasty. Now this one is brown. Um, so I'm not sure what this one would be either. Obviously. It smells like this one is going to be like coffee. And I personally hate coffee. Um, but if you love coffee... I think you would like this. You get more of a smell than a taste. That's why I smell it first. Because I feel like the smell comes out stronger. Yeah, so that's like a hazelnut um, coffee type flavor to it. Next one is just white. I wonder if they have the regular chocolate, or white chocolate or dark chocolate like we do here in America or not. They probably do because that's like a basic thing, but I know Food Olay does that too. They have unique flavors in different countries. This one doesn't really smell like much. Maybe this one is like marshmallow or white chocolate, I'm not sure. Because I don't really taste anything distinct from that. This one should be fun. Um, it's in uh, a different language, but it looks like some type of uh, vanilla ice cream. Maybe like a New Year's flavor, seasonal flavor probably. So this one might be the, their birthday cake, I'm not sure. Yeah, this is probably their birthday cake. You kind of get a coconut flavor. Well, I've also had, in other countries, they have cookies and cream. So that might be what this is. Because I don't know if you can see it. But that's kind of what I'm tasting. Well, I swear it's like coconut type flavor into it. That one's really good, like coconut. That must be coconut. And this looks like that flavor is Halloween, so we'll see. Because in America, they just have, if you're watching this for a different country, um, the regular chocolate ones, and then just use orange food coloring for when we have Halloween. Or just sell them regular as well. Um... So, the, no unique flavor or anything, just different food coloring, which I think is kind of lame. Ew, this is like grape. This is going to be interesting. I didn't know that's literally what it meant by the purple wrapper. Yeah, some type of mixed berry or grape flavor.
It's probably mixed berry because it's tart, I think, to be great. You almost get the sour to it, which I actually like because then it's not overpowering or sweet. Next one. I don't know why I'm looking at it. I think I can read it. Um, once I open it, yeah. Looks like some type of cherry or strawberry color. Yeah, this. The smell is very familiar. Kind of like those strawberry fruit snacks. Kind of. Or like fruit punch maybe. Is what it smells like. This one is definitely sour. Like you can tell they added some sour to it. Um, now this one tastes like um, strawberry cream. So I think what they did was they added the sourness to it. But that's really neat because we don't have any sour Kit Kats in the U.S. So that's actually really neat. That's why I wanted to try this. Um, because I, I just thought it was different and unique. Okay. I think I heard it. Yeah, it's definitely sour. And these were from like multiple different Amazon links, so some of the flavors may be um, repeated. So if that's the case, I apologize. Like I think this one is that same coffee. Yeah, I think that one is that same coffee flavor. Yeah, it is. For sure. This next one is... So unique, like there's not even a picture of it. Anything all the way. Right there, there we go. So I have no clue what this is. But this is kind of fun, because like I said, like the... Hearing, like, reading the title of the flavor doesn't throw me off because I honestly have no clue what it is. Um, so it's kind of fun to not know, like, literally not know what it is that I'm trying other than I know it's going to have wafer in it. Okay. This one, it tastes like pancakes. Oh, why do I keep thinking it tastes? Smells like pancakes or like buttercream. Oh. Yeah, the smell definitely comes out more than the, um... Actual Kit Kat itself, but that I would say buttered syrup pancakes. That's why I'm trying to show them. Uh, this one looks like some type of red velvet cookie almost. I'm trying to see if they have a picture on it to see if I can tell what it is by the picture. Ew. 
this one smells like squash. Definitely not a fan of that. I mean, I don't drink alcohol, so some of these may be like champagne flavor or something like that, and I would have no clue. Um, this one looks like another party one. LOL. I don't know if you can read that kind of a wrapper. It just tastes like just like that other party when we tried. This next one looks like mango. Or peach or like actual orange and I'm hoping it's like actual orange and not just orange food coloring. I might have shown that too fast. It's just brown. So what I think it is, is we actually do have this in America but not Kit Kat. Um, where they infuse orange flavoring into milk chocolate. I think that's what this is. Because it smells just like it. Yes, that is exactly what this is orange flavored milk chocolate I personally do not like orange and milk chocolate or blueberry milk chocolate I do like strawberry and chocolate and cherry and chocolate depending um, but I'm not a big huge chocolate and fruit fan you know like those cream filled chocolates uh, like Fruit cream filled chocolate. Yeah, I'm not a fan of those. This one is sweet potato. I was able to read it because it was on a different package that actually had the English underneath. Um, so this one I know is sweet potato. You know, that would be really, a really good combo for a, like, sweet potato casserole or some pie to add some texture, but you still get that sweet potato taste. Um, you can definitely taste the sweet potato in there. Like, if it wasn't extra sweetened because of the, um, ah, that's funny, that's one I just tried. So we're going to put that off to the side because it won't be open. Now this one looks like another Halloween orange type deal here. Now this one smells like mango or peach of some kind. More of like a peach flavor. This one they add sour to it also. I find it really interesting that they have sour Kit Kat. 
I found that really cool. Now this one may be that same one I had before. Because it looks like the same wrapper. But open it just to see. Yeah, it's that pancake one again, this one. Same pancake one. Okay. I'm just rummaging through the box and I grab one for another video that I'd be doing. You know, this one is like a pale pink. This one is really crumbly. That one, I have to say, would either be strawberry or cherry, but it kind of tastes like those icy, icy slushies, red flavor. It's kind of what it tastes like with a little bit of sour. Or maybe watermelon. I'm not. I'm honestly not sure. Look in the box to see. Oh, okay. So some more. For another video, I just I just put everything in a box together. So stupid. Looks like another cupcake flavor. Yeah, this must be their birthday cake. And they all taste the same. Anything with like a birthday saying on it. Now this one I think is actually chocolate covered strawberry. Because if you look at the uh, picture, that's what it looks like. Looks like maybe they're Valentine's Day. I'm actually not a huge fan of that. There's like a really weird aftertaste, and then it just hits you with sour. That one found really strange. Now this one is a complete was in a completely different package. This one may be like champagne or something. Flavoring. Oh. Smells like game laundry detergent.
God, I cannot eat that. Because I, um, I get anesthesia a lot. Um, because I have to have shots where I go under anesthesia. And it smells just like that, like, gas that they give you. Um, it, I, I so it, like, instantly makes me, makes my stomach hurt. Um, so, sorry, I couldn't really show that, but it was, uh, that gross. Anyway, so that will be a no. Um... Oh, this one's one must be like a Christmas one. It has a cute little uh, polar bear on it. Oh, and this one is cool. It has like pink and chocolate. So it may be like strawberry and chocolate. Oh, that's cool. Look, it even has strawberry wafers in it. Yeah, like white chocolate covered strawberries. Like we never get any of this stuff in America. <laughs> if you're watching from other countries. I know I keep saying that, but this is really cool. Oh. This is just another one of those grape ones. One for another video. Looks like that same lime green one again. Some of these are the same, it looks like. Looks like another one of those white chocolate, but I'm going to open it uh, just in case. Yeah, that's just like plain white chocolate. Here's another one of those achy vegetable ones again. Not doing that. I'm going to put that off to the side. Um, another one of those orange ones. Put that off to the side. Another one of the limes. I can. All the Kit Kats out of the bottom. That's the box.
All right. So this, oh, just check the TV. Um, let's move this box over here quick. Quick like, quick and stealthy. I can Okay. Now this one, because it's just red, might be the regular, like a regular everyday Kit Kat. Yeah, that's what it looks like. Smells like it too. Yep, this one is just a regular milk chocolate. So I don't really need to explain that one. <laughs> 